say that I like Ragged a lot more than uh, I initially did because you've got a fair bit of scope there in terms of the commodities and, and it's a relatively sort of newish um, exploration activity. Um, with the lithium, I've seen some work you guys are doing lithium and, and the nickel. Can you just give us sort of a quick rundown on your th the, your thoughts after all the work since we last mm -hmm. spoke? Well, the, I'll, I'll start with the nickel. So um, the geological survey mapped a nickel gossen and it was recorded in the um, you know mapping sheets, if you like. So we sort of went out there uh, last year um, before you know the border closed um, and went out there, mapped it, sampled um, and we have mapped the Gossen extends over about a kilometre, 100 metres wide. Um, and so before we want a drill test, we've sort of decided to go in and do some ground geophysics um, and follow that up with the potential of identi identifying conductive bodies at depth, which may be, you know, nickel sulphide mineralisation. Um, and then as part of our RC drilling program, we can come in and drill test that. So that's sort of um, the nickel Gossen story, if you like, or we've now called it the Corona Prospect, mm -hmm. um, and we'll be doing that geophysics survey this week um, okay. to sort of follow that up. Um, look, the, the Gossen is uh, very unusual in this sort of area, but it's in the Kamadiites. It sits at the bottom of the basal contact, so it's a very good uh, geographical position to be sitting in, um, and we think it's important to you know, test this Gossen and see you know, what's at depth. Okay. So looking forward to, to following that up. Um, and then the lithium prospectivity, um, we acquired a new tenement to uh, the north or the northeast. And as part of that, we sort of went through and did our due diligence and identified some pegmatites that have been mapped there. And it's also um, along the boundary of the Split Rock Super Suite, which is associated with the world class lithium deposits in the area. Um, so, hence, following up that, on that lithium prospectivity. The project, like you said, it's quite unusual to have um, different commodity focus, um, but we have 100% control of that greenstone belt um, bordering on the granite. So it's quite an interesting area um, that's really been underexplored. Um, it's off the road. Um, we do have tracks in there, um, but it's sort of missed a lot of the exploration activity. So it's a very early stage sort of greenfields project, but a lot of prospectivity and I think exciting times ahead.